What up? What's good? What's happening? Welcome to the 901 Sports Report. I'm Avery Braxton. Happy Tuesday to you. University of Memphis Athletic, Pre Athletic Director and President, they stole the show on Monday talking about all that conference realignment stuff. But today, we can focus because it is Memphis Tigers game week. The boys in blue get their first official face-off on Saturday when they take on Bethune-Cookman in Simmons Bank Liberty Stadium. The goal this year, they say, restore that Memphis brand of football. It's been a fun offseason, it's been a challenging offseason, but very proud of the guys and their mindset and their approach. All this leading up to Saturday where we know we're going to have a big, big, big crowd at Simmons Bank Liberty Stadium for this game and uh, looking forward to playing Bethune-Cookman College. I think we're going to go back out there and people say, that's Memphis football. That's what people are going to be excited to see. And I think as the fans start to catch fire, wow, this is a, this is a product we want to be. They'll continue to show up and uh, we're quite excited about that. Now, the Tennessee Vols brand of football was exciting last season. They opened the year ranked 12th in the nation. Their first test, the Virginia Cavaliers in the Titans Nissan Stadium. Best five words in, in Tennessee is it's football time in Tennessee and uh, officially game week. Looking forward to the opportunity of going and playing with, uh, with this program. Uh, it's awesome that we get an opportunity to start inside of mid-state. We've got a great opponent. Um, we're SEC. Uh, nation's going to be their national TV audience as we kick off the other uh, 23 season. Now you'll be able to catch that game right here on ABC 24. Memphis and Tennessee ain't worried about quarterback. Ole Miss, however, has not named a starter. So we'll talk about why and their options at 10 o'clock. That's your 901 and 91. So stick around. So we got more news after the break.